Hello, if you are watching this, welcome to the first vlog of my channel, Vida Arikido. Here I'm going to just document my life, things I like, things I don't like. Vida Arikido, Vida uh, means life in Spanish and Arikido is a nickname I've had since I was super little. But I thought today would be a great day to start this vlog because it's a day of change and a day of new beginnings. So my voice, you might be able to tell a little echoey. That's because I'm talking to you from an empty apartment. It is moving day. It is moving day and everything is out of here and we are leaving everything that we know in Texas and we're heading to Washington State to be a military wife, y'all. <laughs> um, I got married to my husband in January, January 15th to be exact, so I move this. <laughs> and today is April 22nd and the military is saying we have to go elsewhere. So, yeah, it's a big change for me. I left my career today. Um, I was a journalist for almost a decade, eight years, eight plus years, eight and a half years. <laughs> and wow, wow. Um, so I just thought I would document this journey, this road trip. We're driving from Texas all the way to the Seattle area. I'm leaving my hometown, my friends, my family. I've left them before, you know, for college and, you know, to kick off my career, but I never left Texas. So um, I'm nervous, but also excited. And I am opening up this new chapter and leaving it all in God's hands. I know he will not lead me astray. So here we go. Let's, uh, Let's get to moving. We are, I don't even know. Where are we headed at? Somewhere between New Braunfels and whatever's after New Braunfels. We're going to Dallas right now. <laughs> We're on our way to Dallas. This is night one, April 22nd. Oh, should we be telling the dates? Yeah. April 22nd, 2022. Um, yeah, we're on the road. How you feeling? I feel good. We had an emotional goodbye. Emotional See you later. Goodbye. See you later. There From you go. The fam. The fam. For Selena's. Here, let's ask a question. Better together. Pick this up. You married couples. Some good stuff in here. Oh, oh. Let's see what the question is. What is the best thing an ex would say about you? Ooh. you go first. No, I asked you the first. question. I'm asking the question. That's not how the game goes. The best thing they would say about me? Give me all the juice. Everything. Everything was about. I would say, I'm willing to bet they would say I'm the one that got away. Good morning. Where are we? 
We're in Dallas, Texas, baby. Go Cowboys. <laughs> I was so tired and grumpy by the time we got here last night that I could not vlog. So. And it's. It's 7 18 in the morning. We're gonna get ready, grab free breakfast. We got free breakfast. Huh? We got free breakfast. Yeah. And then hit the road. And where are we driving to today? Kansas City. Missouri. And if you're wondering, or if you're like, that's not on the way <laughs> to Washington from Texas, no, it's not. That'll be secret. My secret? Yeah. My wife loves Funko Pops. I just, <laughs> at some convention, she's dragging me to. <laughs> yeah, no, there's a convention. But, 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 Joey Patone is going to be there. And I do love me some in sync. So, I'm going to start getting ready. Maybe I'll update you um, when we get free breakfast. But this is day two of the trip. It's April 23rd, Saturday, and yeah, it's breakfast time. Morsel time. One thing I'm going to miss about Texas is the Texas-shaped waffles. I think we're the only state that does this at hotels. What? California <laughs> waffles. We're ready to uh, get our day started, and it's time to eat. Yay, we're in the car. He's driving this time. We're going to Kansas City, Missouri. Our car starts, and it's good. Some lady, Cadillac Converter Thief is out there, the bandit. The Cat Converter Bandit is out there. Is that a problem where y'all are at? That's a big problem in Texas right now. People are stealing Cat Converters from cars, and people are waking up and not being able to drive. Yeah, I hope. So yeah, a lady that was, I guess she was checking out, right? She was checking out, said her cat converter was stolen, so that's crazy. Um, but yeah, we're on our way to Kansas City, Missouri. To go to Comic Con. Made it to Kansas City, Missouri. I think the last time we documented, we were eating and we're eating again. So it's more so time. <laughs> and we're at Chili's. Yes, I like Chili's. Don't judge us. All right, we're in hotel number two. We ate. We're stuffed. We've got a big day tomorrow. A Ooh. long day tomorrow. We're going to Comic Con. What is it called? Kansas City Planet Comic Con. Kansas City Planet Comic Con. Um, so we're gonna do that. We're gonna try and get there at 9 a.m. Go to Comic Con, do our thing, meet some people, get some pop signed, and then drive five and a half hours to Lexington, Nebraska. It's all a blur. It's all for <laughs> Oh, we started reading a book. We did start reading a book. It's on the called Lies. Dark. Something, this is something before Lies. Yeah, something, something. It's crazy. We're on chapter seven. Yeah. But, yeah, that's where we're at. I'm sure you can hear the kids screaming at the pool. Oh, yeah, there's a pool right there. <laughs> Do we show them? Honestly, this hotel, not my favorite. That's our, that's our day. We're just driving, eating, driving, eating, sleeping. Jesus uh, Lord. Yes, he is. Good morning. Guess what we just did? We ate. Once the time again. And I forgot the vlogging camera, so, but just more food. Um, where are we going today? Going 
the Comic Con. I always should do a video of the stuff we're gonna get signed. We figured out which one, uh, <laughs> you gonna get baby back ribs? Is it dumb to get Joey Fatone to sign something and say, I want my baby back ribs? And if you don't know, you're not a real NSYNC fan if you don't understand that reference. Ribs. I want my baby back, baby back, baby back. I want my baby back, baby back, baby back. I want my baby back. <laughs> but is that dumb? I don't know, but we'll uh, show you more when we get there. <laughs> A mission for Karate Kid. Round. We got all these pops, comics. We've been waiting in line for an hour already just to get in. I'm only here for one reason and one reason only. <laughs> never thought I'd be at one of these things in my life. Guys, Comic-Con is happening all around me. I'm flipping around. You can see, as you can see, the hubby is in line getting more autographs. But we all know I came for one thing and one thing only. Joey Fatone. The Joey Fatone of NSYNC of the Singing Bee. And my big fat Greek wedding. My child. Hood, Joey Fatone. I don't know if you guys can see, since I want my baby back ribs. If you know, you know. But let me tell you, super cool guy. He was running super late, okay, okay. His signing was supposed to start at 10 a.m. He got here at 10.40, but I was first in line. It was great, he was, he was so cool. Um, had a quick little conversation. I explained to him why I wanted it to say I want my baby back ribs. Of course he knew, he was in the commercial, and if you know you're a real fan, then you know too. Said hello, give me a hug, say take care, God bless, all that good stuff. Now I'm just waiting for my hubby to get his autographs. Um, he's definitely more of a nerd than I am. Actually, he's very much one. Um, <laughs> I don't know who any of these people are. Nebraska officially. Officially. We were only in Iowa for like half an hour, I think. Um, obviously, I did not vlog after I saw Trey. Met back with Trey after I met Joey. He met Ralph Macchio. Cobra Kai. Karate Kid. Yep. The Outsider. Stay Golden Blonde Boy. He didn't say that though. He was in the hospital bed, you know, if you saw the movie, read the book, you know, he was in the hospital. So, we've got about three hours left to go. We're going to stay in Lexington, Nebraska for the night. And then we're on the road again tomorrow. But yeah, this uh, vlog, you know, I really just forget to bring out the camera for a lot of stuff. But you're just living, living in the... Let's pull a card. Pick a card. Any card. Take it from the top of the Oh, it's a juicy one. Describe your wildest desire. Ooh. Tell me. Oh, we gotta turn the camera off. <laughs> Good morning from Lexington, Nebraska. Another day. Another free hotel breakfast. This time, we're the only ones in the breakfast room. Well, one, this is a small town, but two, it's a Monday. People have jobs. It's weird that I don't have a job anymore. <laughs> Left that behind to move across the country. Maybe wife life. Um, I don't know, I'm about to chow down on this breakfast. Have any words you want to say? Good morning, viewer. 
Thanks for coming back. Probably our one and only viewer, but we Thank appreciate you. you. <laughs> Thank you for your service. <laughs> oh, my goodness. It's snowing. Oh, yeah, it was snowing. But like my last day. I missed it all. Sorry, dude. There was dude. so much snow. You missed it all. So much snow. We're you in can... Wyoming. We're in Wyoming, viewer. Why do you keep here? Look at the cows. Oh. There's the cows. Damn, we missed all the you snow. <laughs> Sorry, viewer. You're driving. Whoops. My bad. Uh, Merry Christmas. Uh, you see the snow in the Rocky Mountains. Not the Rocky Mountains, I was just saying Rocky Mountains in general. <laughs> Yo, you trying to make me look bad. <laughs> Alright, if you we gotta have a conversation with this one, so we're gonna we're gonna cut this part short. Alright, viewer, I've redeemed myself. There is some snow left in Wyoming. Look at it. Look at it. We don't see a lot of snow in Texas. Especially Corner in April. Pocket. The fact is April yeah. almost rains. It's almost summertime. Look at it. Uh oh. Are you speeding? Yeah. Hmm. I ain't gonna tell nobody. Yeah. Uh, silly bridge. There we go. Looks really nice. <gasps> Some good quality. Say we're still in the room. I'm driving for a billion hours. Yeah, about 10,000 miles, it seems like. Uh, still got a long way to go tomorrow. You know how long the drive is tomorrow? Another long one. We're going to Sopan, I think. Spokane, that's what it was. Not Spokane. Spokane. there be light we've reached our destination in Hardin Montana ten and a half hour drive today Woo. you did great I drove like eight of them that's crazy thank you Alani energy drinks <laughs> <laughs> um our hotel is kind of cool the guy at the front desk was super cool I got two beds this time Give us some free uh, hats. So, Homestead, yeah. shout out to Homestead and in sponsoring us. I wish. We've been eating a lot of junk lately. Like, really bad food. Chips, fried food, fast food. That's a downside to road tripping. So, we think we're gonna get Subway tonight. Eat fresh. Eat fresh. <laughs> I need some vegetables in my life. Um, but yeah. We're here. Good morning. Trey is watching basketball recap commentary. I don't know. It's the playoffs. And the Nets have suck. Why did you say that on camera? Patty should have stayed with the Spurs. That's all I'm saying. That's all I'm saying. What is this? Day four? Five of our adventure? I don't even know. I don't have to count. Stay four. Um, it's the morning time, so you know what that means. Another day, another hotel breakfast. I've eaten biscuits and gravy the last three days. Maybe there will be something different today. Maybe there won't. We have a nine and a half hour drive today, so shorter than yesterday, but still very long. <clears throat> I'm just ready to get to our new home. We're almost there. This is probably the last, yeah, this is the last big drive. Oh, we, we will be in Washington State today. Yeah, Spokane. 
Yeah. <clears throat> yeah, shout out to Spokane. I actually know a few people from Spokane or who have worked in Spokane. So, let's go. Um, so, let's go. Let's go. Let's just... Let's just go grab breakfast. I couldn't do biscuits and gravy. They do have it, but I feel like I'm going to turn into a biscuit with gravy. So I'm making like a breakfast sandwich thing. I see. Cereal. <laughs> salty eggs. Very salty. Uh, muffin. Got cranberry juice, orange juice. So yeah, that's our breakfast. One thing that's absolutely for sure as we stepped outside to check out our hotel we were not prepared for the cold at all it's like actually i'll tell you the temperature is 39 degrees <laughs> we got texas 39 degrees in hardin montana we came from texas san antonio which was like 85 when we left so <clears throat> we didn't bring any jackets sweaters none of that fill up and hit the road again. Just wanted to document the pretty trees, the winding road. Husband is driving. He's actually driven this whole time. So props to him. I've never seen so much nature <laughs> living in this city. It's funny. We made it to Washington State. Spokane. Took a hot minute to get into our hotel, but we're here. <laughs> Might try to find something fun to do, because also we're two hours behind what we're used to, the time zone. So, gotta, I mean, it's only four o'clock p.m., so we've got some time in our day. I'm trying to find an Ulta. And Ulta would be nice. So maybe we'll go to the mall, walk around, stretch our legs since we've been driving. Literally all we do is drive, sleep, and, <laughs> and eat. So, hey, so, we, stop. <laughs> Leave me alone, nah. Gosh. We found the mall. We found an Ulta. We also discovered that Washington State, you have to bring your own bag, recyclable, reusable bags, or they charge you eight cents a bag if you don't. Statewide law, we did not know. We don't have that law in Texas. Um, I think Austin, Texas has it, but it's not like statewide or anything. So, anyways, I went to Ulta and I want to show you guys what I got. You don't need to know my total, <laughs> but if you shop at Ulta, you probably could guess what it is. So, you see, I got this um, baking powder by Beauty Bakery. I've heard good things about this brand, so I thought I would try it out. Speaking of Beauty Bakery, I also got these makeup blending eggs. I see, I like this brand because everything is like baking related. I usually buy the Real Technique Beauty Blender dupes because they're cheaper. But this whole carton was $18, so okay, that's what they look like. Um, this is a repurchase. I love this stuff. The Morphe Continuous Setting Mist Spray stuff. Got that. I got, ooh, so I'm trying not to wear foundation as much. I've just been doing like concealer, powder, but I, you know, if you want more coverage but not a thick foundation, I heard these Fenty Beauty what are they called? Ease drops for good. I hope this is my shade. I haven't bought Fenty like skin product in a while, but I just guesstimated. This light's very yellow, so you probably can't tell. But it looked like it looks like it's gonna match me. I got the number 17. Repurchase. I got the MAC concealer. I'm an NC42 if you're curious. I used to use this back in the college days. Honestly, I know MAC is a dying like brand, but it's an oldie but a goodie. And then Ariana Grande has her makeup align REM Beauty now. 
and so I bought this uh, what is this called it's called practically permanent lip stain marker so the reason why back in high school I used to love using lip stain markers this is before liquid lipsticks were a thing before Kylie came out with her lip kits liquid markers not liquid markers <laughs> lip stain markers were where it was at I used to have so many colors and yeah they discontinued them like I don't know any brand that still makes them so when Ariana came out with it I figured I would try it again see if I still like them the same this is called this is in the shade booked and ooh, I already like it in the shade booked and busy you can not see this light is so yellow but that's what I got from Ulta also I swatched her coal eyeliner right here and it's been stuck on me the last couple hours I've washed my hands everything sanitizer doesn't budge so if you're interested it works what'd you get from Ulta nothing <laughs> Good morning! We've got basketball highlights recaps, the huge. <laughs> um, it's a new day. I started using some of my new makeup that I bought from the Ulta haul. Two things the Ariana Grande lip stain. It's a no for me, dog. I really wanted to like it. I don't know how I used to use those markers back in the day, but it was just so patchy. I have to go over it with a lipstick that I normally use so mm, that was a no and then the MAC concealer I accidentally bought the wrong shade so I just need to get one shade darker so mm, mm, that's our review makeup sponges great I think I'm gonna start buying the beauty bakery ones from now on <clears throat> the powder love that too what else did I get yesterday pretty much I liked everything I got yesterday oh the skin tint what do, it's kind of, I'm kind of getting blown out, but Rihanna did her thing with the eavesdrops or whatever it's called. Um, I don't say anything. Are you trying any new products? Um, <laughs> any new body no, wash? No new... new body wash. Um, still using the old spice. <laughs> That's it. Anyways, we're gonna try to get we're not trying we're gonna get breakfast right yeah hotel yeah. breakfast our last free hotel breakfast yeah Brandy. what do you think it's gonna be guys biscuits and gravy that's what we're off to and then we'll be in seattle later today well the area we're living in near seattle and uh i'm excited to be in uh to be in our new our new home what it's biscuits and gravy okay. Again, I didn't eat it yesterday. I was close, but I didn't. This is, I thought I was gonna turn into a biscuit and gravy. But since this is our last stop, it's all right. Trey's had Fruit Loops like <laughs> three, three days in a row. Mm -hmm. But it's our last breakfast, cranberry juice. What'd you get? Orange juice, apple juice mixture. Orange, apple combine. Let's eat. We are, let's see if we can use that technique, Squidward. Ooh, I'm doing it. We have two hours and 23 minutes left. Look at the, the windmills, or also known as the turbines. Um, the missus is looking lovely as ever. You're doing a great job, baby. <laughs> She's following the speed limit, so, you know, we're not going to get pulled over. And, oh, let's do a question. All right. Do you have a secret hunch about how you will die? Ooh. No, I think that's very morbid. Very morbid. All I know is I don't, how I don't want to die. I don't know how. Everybody knows how they don't want to die. <laughs> don't drown me. Don't burn me alive. Don't stab me <laughs> this time. Just shoot me. Just shoot me. If I'm going to be murdered, just shoot me. All right, Erica's murderer. If you're uh, watching this video, just shoot me. I don't even be stabbed 50 times. I've watched too much true crime. I'm like, that poor girl was alive until the 30th stab. The 30th stab. Oh. Uh, how? A hunch? How I would die? It's actually a trick question. I'm going to be alive until Jesus comes back. <laughs> Rapture ready. Look at the shirt. I ain't even playing this. Look at that. Um, but no, how will I die? In my sleep peacefully. Yeah, that's, that's like 
That's what everybody wants. That's the goal. That's, that's the dying goal. Yeah. Not a car crash. Not drowning. I want to die with my loved ones around me. After that, but then that could be terrible. It was like a happy, oh, happy birthday. We have two hours left. The next video, we will be in our apartment. Not the next video, but the next portion of this video. Shout out to you, viewer, for watching this very extremely I long. Die that you call them I don't know how she's going to edit this. It's going to be 30 minutes. I don't know if people are going to watch it that long, but however long this video is, viewer, we appreciate you staying <laughs> all the way through seeing this experience. If you didn't skip through it, you saw her ultra haul and all of that good stuff. Um, is there something I can show you? Can I do a haul? I don't have a haul. Yes, what? We're home. Got a lot of stuff, just a lot of stuff. But we're home, I wanted to document it real quick. We got errands to run, go to Target, get essentials, stuff like that. But priorities, I gotta go get my nails done. Cause we're going on our honeymoon tomorrow. So yeah, we're home. And it was quite the drive, quite the experience. But I'm very excited. Would you do it again? Got some uh, James Avery. If you're from Texas, if you know, you know. But, all right. Good morning, another day. More basketball highlights and recaps. Playoffs. <laughs> we woke up in our home for the first time today. So then an air mattress. It was very cold because it's still like basically winter out here, which we're not used to. As you can see, we're already getting ready to leave. We are going to Hawaii, a late honeymoon because we got married in January. It's now April, end of April. It'll be May by the time we come back. <laughs> um, so yeah, we're gonna document that trip, but it'll be in a different vlog than this one. So if you wanna see it, maybe I'll have a link below or something like that. 